Hi everyone, my name is Carolina de Robertis and I love you librarians. You are incredible and amazing. Thank you for everything that you do. I uh, came to this country when I was 10 years old as an immigrant and my local public library was my refuge and they still are refuges for millions of people all over the country. Thank you for everything that you do now more than ever. Um, I'm here today to talk about my book Cantoras which um, is just now out in paperback and in September is coming out in Spanish with Vintage Español. I had the incredible pleasure of translating the book myself. What an adventure. Um, it's also called Cantoras in Spanish. Um, Cantoras is set in over the course of 35 years beginning in the 1970s in Uruguay and follows the lives of five queer women who um, find each other during the bleak years of the dictatorship and turn to their friendship and connection for um, love, certainly, but also survival and, and, and connection and chosen family and strength over the years. Um, it's a book about a small, faraway country and a different time, but it's also a book, I think, very much about all of us in that um, these queer women are based on real people who I've met and listened to for 18 years um, before and during the writing of this book. Um, and I was just blown away by their courage. And um, one of the questions I think this book asks is, how do we live radiantly when the world seems bent on our erasure? Um, how do we forge real connection and community, resilience and hope, um, when the world feels like it's falling apart or has shut down. And um, alas, I think that these are themes that continue to be uh, relevant and meaningful to many of us in these times. Um, but you know, hope is also relevant and resilience is also relevant. Um, and reading can be one incredible source of resilience and hope. So thank you for listening. Um, and I wish you much joyful reading and connection and many good things. Mucho amor. Y mucho ánimo.